before I get going with this video guys, I'm going to tell you a little bit of a backstory about me and the person within this video so you can understand the context and some of the things that I said. The long story short is he basically bullied me for a solid three years until I left the school because I couldn't take it anymore. He literally sent me to hospital once or twice, he used to take the piss out of everything I did. He was a massive homophobe and yada yada. I'm not gay, but he literally made me question my own sexuality the amount of times that he told me that I was. Literally, he made my life a living hell and I was so happy when I left that school. Bearing that in mind, I received a message a couple of days ago saying this. Yo, is this Mike? And at the time, I did not know who this was. I thought my number had been leaked. So I was very, very confused and like wary about who was messaging me. So I said, uh, who's this? You know, it's standard message. And he replies with, it's we used to go to school together, remember? And I said, oh, oh yeah, shit, I fucking remember you. And then he sent this message. Mate, I'm so sorry about what we used to do to you back in the day. Oh, I feel so bad for it, G. I guess it must have been the drugs that were making me do this shit to you. And Are we cool now, mate? And just before he sent that message, I was listening to this song called Cold Water over the radio. And I thought, do you know what? I'm going to prank this bastard with song lyrics. Everybody gets high sometimes, you know. Yeah, man, I feel you. It's great to see you becoming so big and shit, man. Like, I'm glad you understand where I'm coming from. Do you smoke weed then, bro? What else can we do when we're feeling low? I feel you, man. Come around mine soon, yeah? We can record a video or two and then bond on some of that good shit. You feel me, G? So take LMAO, laughing my ass off for those of you people that do not understand that. You creased me right up, Michael. We always knew you'd be a funny guy. But yeah, that is how you smoke weed, is it, lol? You shouldn't be drowning on your own. You think about doing bongs, LMAO? You're a right laugh, man. We definitely need to meet up. And if you feel you're sinking, I will jump right over into cold, cold water for you. Bro, that mean a lot, you know, getting like a minor celebrity like you being there for me, man. Like, I should have been there for you back in school, but I think me bullying you helped you become who you are. So I, I guess you kind of owe me. <laughs> no, I don't. I owe you fuck all. And all time may take us into different places. I will still be patient with you. And I hope you know. Know what, brother? Won't let go of what? Like what I did back in the day? Cause we all get lost sometimes, you know. Yeah man, I, I get that. It's how we learn and how we grow. Mate, I promise you, yeah, that I've learned so much in school, G. I swear I'm like a different guy, innit? Mate, I could see us actually going and doing shit together, man, like for time, bro. Nah, bruv, none of that gay faggot shit, you freak. I'm not a fucking homo, yeah? You shouldn't be fighting on your own. Bruv, I'm not gay, allow it, you weirdo. Mate, I thought you were chill, yeah? I was literally gonna ask if you wanted to come out of us lads later. But you're a fucking faggot, man. I'm glad your dad passed away. He probably overdosed because he was ashamed of his faggot son. Now, 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 now you can see why, um... I don't like this person. <laughs> like that. He's a different person, it's mad. And I hope you know. I'm sorry for those messages. That weren't me, fam. <laughs> Question mark. I just wanna stay awesome. Is this not one of them euphemisms? I'm all alone. Nah, you're not, fam. I would say I'd give you a lift, but I lost my license for drunk driving, LMAO. Let go of what? Bruv, I'm not holding anything. What are you on? Oi, can you search up Justin Bieber Cold Water for me, man? Yeah, okay. Why? Uh, you'll see. You really got a faggot if you listen to this shit, LMAO. Fucking hell. It's called a lyric prank, mate. Do you want to say hello to YouTube? You're a fucking little cunt. You know that. I swear to God, if people might ever see you in fucking public again, I'm going to fucking slit your dumb ass wide open. One, that sounded a little gay. 
Are you sure that you're definitely not? Two, it's not exactly smart to threaten me in a YouTube video, is it? I don't give a fuck, cuz. This won't be a YouTube video, cuz you'll be in the same position as your fucking dad before you could upload it. Just you fucking way. Your story, mate. Uh, have fun getting over with your life, uh, you golem looking twat. Fuck you, your videos are shit anyway. So yeah, um, that happened.